Peace family, this is Lions Den with another news and commentary. I'm going to go ahead and do another um, tribute today. Today is the one year anniversary of the death of Fernando Castillo. Uh, a Minnesota um, gun owner um, was with his girlfriend. Um, for those of you who don't remember or don't know about, um, he was riding along and been, st- and been stopped by, uh, by police. Basically, he was cooperating with the police officer. He, he, Fernando himself said that he had a gun in his glove compartment. And once he reached for his ID, that's when the police officer shot and killed him in front of his girlfriend, in front of his girlfriend's daughter. Now, the video I'm about to play um, is graphic. And, and I know there's kids on reaction so again um uh, if believe me um if you have children i suggest not to watch this video because it's too graphic for them uh but it shows what happened and i'm going to continue playing um the press conferences of the families of fernando castillo since today is the one year anniversary of his death so i'm gonna go ahead and play this video and i'm gonna continue the rest of my commentary Now, before I start, this is remember this is the police officer's dash cam of the incident. So yes, this is gonna be graphic. Um, again, like I said, if you have children or small children, it's best not to even let them see this video um, because it's too graphic. But I'm gonna go ahead and show this video of to remember Fernando Castillo, and I'm gonna do videos. I'm basically gonna do for inter, for interviews of family that you know, talks about Fernando Castillo, what kind of man he was, um, how how good a man he was. As, and so I'm going to go ahead and play this video since today is a one-year anniversary. Oh, excuse me, a two-year anniversary. I'm sorry. I apologize. I'm going to get, get this together. A two-year anniversary. Uh, today's a two-year anniversary of Fernando Castillo's death. So I'm going to go ahead and play this video, and I'm going to continue the rest of my commentary. <laughs> Well, sir, uh, the reason I told you over you, your brake lights are out. So you only have one activated, active brake light, and that's going to be your passenger side one, your third brake light, which is up here on top, and on this one back here, it's going to be out. Do you have your license insurance? I do have a okay. firearm okay. on me. Don't reach for it, then. I'm, I'm, I'm Don't pull it out. I'm, I'm Don't pull it out. Oh, my God, you just killed my boy. Oh, my God, he wasn't reaching. Don't pull it out. He wasn't. Go, go. Fuck. Oh, man, I can't Fuck. Fuck. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Go, go. Oh, my God. Go, go. Officer know that he was, he had a fire 
here so we can fucking block off everybody over there. Can we get a... Copy, 
We're going to keep all the traffic blocks off here. Are you able to move okay. the up so they're not all filming across the up right now? Okay. Maybe mine or something? I need you to just breathe. Okay. Breathe. Which direction did you fire your weapon? Right at the driver. I had her right out. Okay. I had it pointed down. I don't know how many rounds I let out or anything. Okay. So you were... I just need to know which one's your car right here. Mine's the one that's pulling them over. Okay. So you pointed just directly ahead of Just directly ahead of I had it at my waist. Was he sitting in the car? Was he, he was sitting in the car, seat belted. <clears throat> I told him, that's your license. And then, told me he has a firearm. I told him not to reach for it. And when he went down to grab, I told him not to reach for it. <clears throat> and then he kept it right there. And I told him to take his hands off of it. And then he, he had his, Grip a lot wider than a wallet. Okay. And I don't know where the gun was. He didn't tell me where the fucking gun was. Okay. And then it was just getting hanky. He gave, he was just staring straight ahead. And then I was getting fucking nervous. And then I told him, I know, I know fucking, I told him to get his fucking hand off his gun. Okay. Okay. Is everybody, is everybody, Fuck. is everybody in custody? Do we have everybody? Were there yeah. two there people in the car? Three people in the three car. In the it was car. a female. The front passenger, the little girl in the back. Breathe. Breathe. And the dude. Okay. From having been through this before, so that's going to be real quick. But, okay. So I know, I know you want to talk about it, but those are things we need to know. Yep. If, if there's any other suspects, you said no. Yep. What direction did you fire your weapon? Yep. I had down his hip. I had it pointed down. Into the diagonal. Okay. Nope. So we're just bringing it on. Into the no. car. Yep. It's, it's all around during the okay. car. Good, okay. Good work. And then there's no other outstanding suspect and nobody else is injured that you know of. Nobody else is injured that I know of. Okay, okay. let's get you out of here, buddy. Yep. Okay, guys. Um, you just saw the most disgusting, vile thing I've ever saw. And remember, this is the two-year anniversary of the death of Fernando Castillo. And obviously, you saw what happened. This is the dash cam of that the cat the, the a police dash cam of the incident. Now, I'm thinking about posting the girlfriend's Facebook video live, but that's even more graphic, and I don't want you know the kids to see that at all. That's no. But I'm, what I will do instead is that I'm going to do um, post-interviews like I did with uh, Elton Sterling. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and do the um, interviews with Fernando Castillo's family because um, this is also the anniversary as well as Elton Sterling because, you know, they both died in the same month in the same year. So, and I'm going to go ahead and do that. And today is the two-year anniversary of Fernando Castillo's death. Yesterday was the anniversary of Elton Sterling's death. So they, they both were killed a day apart. So again, I'm going to um, continue, do the continued coverage of the Fernando Castillo while um, doing this video. And again, um, for the children that's on reaction, I apologize for the graphic because I know this is going to be graphic of what happened. So hopefully that the kids don't see this video. It, but it but it shows to to remember the victims. It's not just I'm just posting that. Well, I'm just posting it. But it's remember Fernando Castillo, who he was, and and how he is. So I'm going to go ahead and um, do a part two of the video. But this time it's going to be interviewing by the families of Fernando Castillo. With that being said, it's the Lions Den signing off. Deuces. <laughs>